Okay, so today we were in Wanakina at the ranger school in enemy territory today because most of you know I'm a smitty. But, uh, yeah, out here for a job thing and uh, gonna try a little fishing. We got our first fish of the trip or of today, a little perch. Not too small, I've caught in, uh, some smaller ones here. The last couple of days he's about midpoint. I caught some real big ones and some real small ones. That one's about an average size one, so. Alrighty, finally got something decent here. Oh, something else just took off. Is it a largey or a smallie? There's nowhere good to put down the rod. Nice small mouth. Be careful where you grab the hooks. Alrighty, nice, uh, I think this is part of Cranberry Lake, I'm not even sure. Or some river I can't pronounce the name of. I don't know how well you can see on the camera. I'm experimenting with a new, uh, just using a regular uh, gold Rapala. And uh, nice little smallmouth there. Um, I'm experimenting with, uh, I put this hat mount on a different hat, so I don't know how it's working on the camera. but first decent sized fish. He's about uh, 13 inches, something like that. There he is. Got him, finally. Now it's a bass. There's definitely a... Oh, and I came off again. Ah, oh, dang it. That time was a bass. There's definitely a pike that hit it the one time. The last one I missed. Here we go. Let's see if I can actually catch the thing this time. What is it this time? It looks like a little bass. Can't even tell. No, came off again. I think I couldn't tell what that one was. <laughs> These things are masterminds of spitting the hook all of a sudden. Let's see if we get bit again. Been creating a lot of commotion. Can't believe they keep coming back. Look at that. Whoa, she's see the size of that fish. That was a big one that just looked at it. Oh my gosh. I think what's happening is the perch are chasing my, my freaking lure. And then the big fish are chasing after the, uh, the perch. There's like multiple pike and multiple bass out there right now. This is crazy. It's a little fish. Let go. Nuts. Okay. Got something. What the heck is biting? Smallmouth. Little smallmouth. At least I landed one. <laughs> there's a school of little smallmouth there, and I'm almost positive there's a pike mixed in with the school of little smallmouth. And I think there's perch mixed in with them too. But it's just crazy. Oop, there, something boiled at it. There we go. Do I got him? No, I missed him. Dang it. The little one anyway. I'll tell you, though, getting hits jerk in the float and repolish is so much fun. Whoa! Did you see that thing hit it like a freaking missile? Whoa! <laughs> this is so much fun. That thing hit it like a freaking missile. Oh, boy, he's not out well. I'm going to freaking lose him. Gotta swing him fast. Got him. <laughs> I think our nicest of the day so far. <laughs> this is turning out to be a decent fishing video. I, if I'm getting it, like I said, I'm experimenting. Uh, I'm mounting it on a different hat, so I don't know how well this video is going to come out. Boy, I sure hope I'm getting all this action on all the, uh, the hits and stuff on film. That last one, he hit that thing like a freaking missile. It's definitely our nicest of the day. Ah, boy, he's hooked really weird. He is hooked super weird. Okay, here's the release. He's hooked right in the mouth, but I had a pretty tough time uh, getting it out. Not a very big one. He's uh, he's only about, you know, 12, 13 inches. 
but uh, maybe 13 and a half. He's, she I should say, is good and fat and pregnant. There it goes. Wow. <laughs> All right, let's keep fishing. There's a school of them out there. Here we go. Oh, I can't kill them. I can't knock them. I can't knock them. Some hit right next to shore and scared the crap out of me. Could be, uh, could be the last fish of the day. I have a feeling I'm going to catch another one or two yet. Got on another one. It's not very big, but it's a fighter. I <laughs> said, told myself it was going to be the honorary last cast here. And that's when she hit. Not a huge one, but boy, do these smallmouth fight. <laughs> smallmouth in the Adirondacks, I think, fight harder than the smallmouth uh, in the Alleghenies, for sure. Yeesh. I gotta be careful that it doesn't, uh, treble hooks, I don't want it in, in me here. Oh, boy. Ah, there she is. I don't know how I can see on the camera. It's getting dark, and again, I think the camera's at a little bit of an awkward angle, but I kind of had to roll with what I had. <laughs> and, uh, oh, boy. Every single one of these have got an issue with how they're hooking themselves. This one's hooked, uh, I don't know, down uh, in the stomach pretty good. So we're going to have to doctor it up and, and get those hooks out and release it. But look at that fish. Wow. Oh, it's too dark to see. Big old loon just landed right in front of me. Right in front of me. That's awesome. Love the Adirondacks. Well, as you can see, it's getting dark, so we're going to call it quits here. Uh, I'll show you what I was using real quick. Just a regular old um, uh, golden Rapala, just letting it float to the surface, then ripping it, then letting it float to the surface, then ripping it, then letting it float to the surface, um, creating that surface commotion. I found that this is what they've been keying in on, creating that surface commotion. Um, and that's actually my favorite way to catch the smallmouth uh, out at Paul Smith College, and uh, so I decided to try it here at Wanakina at the Rival School, and uh, works here as well. So, uh, yeah, uh, great day of fishing. Smallmouth are just a, 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 a ball to catch, especially in the Adirondacks. They always seem to fight harder. So, uh, only had, you know, a little over an hour to fish, but still had a great time. Um, so, probably be my last Adirondack fishing video for a long time, but uh, you never know. Um, you know, I always try and make it up here every chance I get. So, thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe. Now it's time to put on my hoodie. Smitty's for life.